I don't. <laughs> if I did, I wouldn't play the accordion. <laughs> Actually, I do care enough about you that I drove all the way down into Philly. Ethan and I drove all the way down into Philly today to get me a new accordion because my old one was broken. Not that you would know by listening to it. But. <laughs> That's a great thing. It sounds like it sounds like a joke, but the setup of how do you tell a broken accordion from a working accordion? It's not. The well, point is, you don't. You don't. You don't. It's not, you know. <laughs> And the great thing is we sold his other accordions to, to the guys at, at the shop and we're like, here are the accordions. They're like, do they work? And we're like, we think. And they're like, and they're like sure, close enough. So it's, it's not just the average layperson, it's the experts, the in, the, them. The experts in the field, so to speak. We're like, yeah, close enough for Plesmer. Um, all right. Said I wanna do right.